this problem we have a sequence and we're being asked if it converges or diverges and if it converges find the limit so whenever you're doing problems like this you always want to consider what happens to this when uh, n approaches uh, infinity so in this case what happens is that this piece here will approach 1 and that's because these degrees are the same and whenever that happens, um, the answer is going to be the ratio of the leading coefficients. So if you take the limit here, uh, it's going to be 1. If you think about it, intuitively, for big values of n, um, you can ignore the 1, so it really behaves like n over n, which is just 1. Now this here oscillates, right? This goes back and forth. Uh, so basically, what's going to happen is that this whole thing uh, will be d and e. So when you take this limit, uh, the answer is going to be D and E. And again, it's really the fact that this piece here approaches 1, and then this just oscillates back and forth. Uh, it's either 1 or negative 1, 1 or negative 1. So the sequence is not really approaching uh, any particular number. So we say that the limit does not exist. So in this case, we would say that the sequence diverges.